Hey everybody, my name is Master Rafflers and welcome to some good old-fashioned gaming. We're playing some, well, Knight's Province. It's a strategy game. We gotta build up our own civilization, make sure it doesn't crumble while also managing the economy, <coughs> the economy as well as um, the jobs of our little townsfolk here. So as you can see, just building up some roads. I'm gonna build a cottage here for some quick population gain. I'm gonna build a school as well, maybe on this area and then we can build a house right here and you know, we got really a building block set up we'll get a militia as well so that we can also scout out the area and yep let's just go as you see it's just like one of those like town management games so to speak I'm building my own civilization I'm, I'm making them don't go to work nobody's allowed to have free time except for eating really about it really about it let's see if I'm still recording I am still recording I've done this like three times and the reason why is because I'm just stupid. Yes, yes, uh, it was just yes. um. Tr trust me, it's it's uh when you see what my mistake was. You see, I thought this was stone, and the stone cutters weren't cutting it. I was like, why? It, it looks like stone. It has the same color as stone. It should be stone, but no, that's not stone. You will see what stone is soon enough. You will. Uh, let's go ahead and just expand out like this. Once we get the cottage, we can get like this setup actually as well come on buddy speed that ass up all right 28 20 fucking eight okay and that would be stone right there so I made a grave mistake let's put it lightly like that though everybody knows master office doesn't make mistakes they're just happy accidents Happy yes. accidents. Yes. Um, yes. Cannot yes. find yes. a militia, yes. actually. Yes. Where are you, militia? Oh, there you are. Militia, I need you to just go. Go this way. And don't stop until you find the enemy. Alright, we got about 27 um, dudes and gals. 20 out of 20 residents, 20 out of 20 residents. So we should have like 40 at some point. Okay. So let's uh, go ahead. First, let's let's get this out. Let's get this out of the way. We can get one of these. So we can get one of these. And then afterwards, I would love to get out maybe um just some woodcutters here and a woodcutter here. And yeah, that should just about do it. Then we can just get a a road that kind of connects both of these guys. Oh my God! I do not have steady hands. Do not trust me for being a surgeon. All right, there we go. We've got ourselves a bustling little metropolis being built here. Get some stonemasons, some wood cutters. The works really. Let me just eat some food while I wait. Mmm. Rice. Rice is literally the backbone of my um, my meal plans. Honestly, I can't eat meat without rice. I just I just can't eat it raw. You know. Now. The only thing that could really substitute rice, in my eyes, is noodles. Otherwise, like, eating like just a, just like a, a big piece of beef, just swallowing it up, is just weird to me. Yes. Unless it's like chicken on a stick, but like, that's why I'm not a really big fan of steak, honestly. Not, not the biggest fan on the, in the planet. So Mason, getting to work. Good job. The Master Rothless labor camps are already at full swing. That's a big chunk of stone. I don't know when that's going to go away, but it's the size of a mountain, so I would assume it's going to be for a while, actually. All right, once our basic resources are done, we can get to food. And food will be easy. We're just going to probably, like, build up this area here. So let's just uh, go here, get that, get that. Hmm. Good enough. Maybe a, a longer road here as well would be nice. That way we can get the tavern. This will allow us to get some food. Uh, we're gonna need a sawmill actually from the most for the from the looks of it actually. Can't get one here. We can get one right here. For um 
like I click on the sawmill. Yeah, that's a little bit of an issue. Hey, because the floor, floor plan is not even done yet. Yep, okay, so now floor. Yeah, we should have enough, honestly, to get everything we want. Provided we're not idiots, of course, you know? And I would like to think my people are very intelligent. Much like myself. So, you know what? I think that they can handle this. Yes. Uh, granted, they all seem to be focusing on the road, but, you know, hey, they're, they're working on it. They're working on it. And I'm going to tell these guys to only cut down the trees. That's because we don't really need to uh, plant right now. We just need to just kind of, like, get rid of this, like, the amount of trees we have in our territory. There's a lot of trees. There's quite a lot of trees that we don't really need. Um, and then afterwards, once we get rid of a couple of them, then we can, we can think about adding in, like, some more trees to our lands. Only when all the trees are gone will we actually miss them. Alright, so can you slaves, oh, I'm not slaves, I mean, uh, paid prisoners with jobs. Can you guys, like, go ahead and keep delivering the, the goods? Thank you, thank you. We found the enemy base. There are military units in this game. So war will be a coming. It will be a coming. When will it come? I, 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 your guess is as good as mine, actually. I don't really know myself. Hmm. Is that like 14? 14 clubs. We got 14 clubs. That's good. Uh, let's get the sawmill, guys, so that we can get some planks going. Alright, so now that I got this out of the way, we can now finally get a farm. With O McDonald and whatever. Oh no. Yes, thank you, Woodcutter. I appreciate you so much. Should get maybe a cider maker, that'd be nice. <clears throat> hmm. Cider maker, where are you? Oh, store? That's good. That's good. Uh, how about we... Oh, nice. Nice. I can't flip this for some reason, which is awkward and annoying because I can only flip this in one direction, basically. What does this mean? What, are you out of trees? Okay, you can, I guess, plant it fell. I don't know. There's still trees for you to basically destroy, but hey, if you're going to deforest the area, go ahead. Be my guest, you know? got like a lot of logs don't we yeah 47 logs nine planks so it's not looking too hot for us but we're gonna make it work i think right the farm the farm needs somebody cider would be good so let's get an orchard out Like, um, I don't know what I need. I need something, dude. Like, I need, like, a road. Yes. How about we do that? And you know what we'll do? We'll build a road, like, right now. Yeah. Build, like, something like here. That's good road. Cow farm would be excellent, though. Yeah, cause cow I feel like cows are a good breakfast meal, right? You got your protein. Your protein! Yeah! Let's go ahead and do that. Cows here, like so. Well, we need like a cow class. Is there a cow class? There's a butcher, a breeder. Okay. Got a farmer. We do need a baker. Yes. Otherwise, that those resources are gonna go down the drain. Actually. Come on. It's so small. God. Just this one air. I wish I could prioritize which trees can be chopped down and which cannot, but unfortunately, I cannot. 
Alas, the technology is too advanced for us. Even though there's been a million RTS games to do it. Yeah, that sawmill guy is gonna have a lot of work on his hands, cause he's just gonna keep on just kinda carving for the most part. Yeah, good job. Good flippin' job. Hmm, let's see if we can maybe get a cottage here. I don't know, we need, we need more people, obviously. Maybe some more builders in general would be great. Blank? Just blank. That's it, he's just a blank. Food situation is gonna be really dicey if we're done. We don't build things fast enough. That's the biggest problem there. There's the mill. Yep, it's right there. Yeah, without without planks, we're gonna be in a very dicey po uh, part of our lives here. We're gonna be starving. That's not good. That is really not good. Yeah, I would consider starving a very bad thing indeed. Now we don't have any issue with stone. Might be because stone is a little bit easier to produce than uh, planks, obviously. Yeah, don't keep at it. Really, like, somebody should be, like, hammering this in and finishing it off. We have the stone necessary, so I don't know why this is, like, not working out. Okay, the stone is coming. The stone is coming. Yep, there we go. Final stone is made, and... Yeah, I mean, that should be done by now. We already have the breeder there. We need a guy to work on the mill, so let's get, like, a miller, I suppose. Oh, McDonald, Hannah Farm. E-I-E-I-O. Yes. 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 Yes, my lord. Cider maker would be good as well. Cider maker, cider maker, cider maker. No, wait, what? Is that really him? Is that really what you need? Yes, it is actually. Wow. Wow. Would you look at that? Hmm, a butcher. I am actually pretty good with a butcher being here, actually. Henry as well would be great. But I think the best thing we could get is probably another sawmill because. That would just expedite this whole problem. Let's build into the desert, I guess. Why not? Yeah, I know, Baker. You're still getting your planks ready, and... Well, we're a little bit slow on things, but hey, hey, it's working, it's working. All the bells and whistles are there. The stone is being used at a rapid pace, actually. We only have, like, 14 stone left now. We need four stone there. We need three there. And we're done here. We're done here. Yeah, wow. We need two stone here, actually. I love when the woodcutters are just like, I am in T-pose. T-pose for me. Hmm. Shame I can't make rice fields in this game. Yes. Yes. It's a good thing my people can't die of like salmonella or something. That'd be a little bit cool. Ah, there we go. We got some supplies here. We just got, we just need one person to go on plank duty. We probably should have gotten the second carpenter like way earlier. Way, way, way earlier. Like, but now we have a brewer and a, um, what is this guy? A baker. 
It's because their buildings aren't even finished up yet. Like, it's a little bit crazy. Woodcutters have 44 logs. Some? Ah, whatever. No way to get fish because we don't. We're not near any bodies of ocean. There's also magma here, or something. I don't know if there's fish. You gotta be 100% honest with you, Chief. I don't think there's fish. Where's the cows going? Cottage is being finished up. Sawmills are working like a charm, so now things are actually running. Like, we don't have, like, a, a humongous issue in terms of our supply. Things I have wanted to build for so long are finally here, so that's good. Ah, look at this. Jobs. Finally. An economy that doesn't suck. Do we have a butcher? Yes. No, we don't have a butcher, no. Someone become a butcher. We've got most of the jobs here besides maybe a fisherman and a miner, blacksmith, yeah. Food will be coming in shortly. Oh my god. What did I do? Hmm. Okay, camp. Store, cottage, schoolhouse, tavern. So far, so good. Cow farm. Butcher. Cider maker. Farm. Mill. Tannery. We need to get that tannery, yeah. Tannery and brewery. Oh. Brewery? I don't know how to pronounce that actually. Yeah, English language and me do not get along, obviously, as you can probably tell. Um, you know, how about we just get something small here? Yeah, set up shop right there. And afterwards, we can get one guy, like maybe he. I don't know, the tree's in the way. The tree's in the way. That's a little bit annoying. Nobody's picking up that log, which annoys the shit out of me. I can't really, like, build properly like that. Can you guys... Yeah, can you guys actually just only fell now? Yeah, there's just a lot. There's, there's quite a lot. Oh! The baker, right. Yes. Mm, I thought the tree might fuck things up, but nope, I yes. did not touch the tree at all. Uh, hey, we can, we can get this area at least. It's so pretty. I've got like this pretty little civilization going. Look, there's all these trees here you can get rid of. I don't know why you're not going this way. Go, go this way. Go up north where there's trees. I have a butcher. What are you waiting for? Have you not been building cows? Are you not building cows, sir? Alright, Tanner, 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 Tanner. My people aren't starving. I would blow. I would blow. I 
How's our mill going? Hey, it's working. We just need the baker and then we're, I think we're done. I do kind of want more plow fields. Now this is something I just don't quite understand. Maybe if I build a woodcutter right here, and one right here, things will be a little bit better. Needs grain. Ah, so you just don't have grain maybe. That's probably just it. Maybe grain has just not matured yet. But there is some mature grain there. We just probably need to build up this a little bit more. Yeah. We need a second farmer too. We have two grain resources. Can't believe no one's working on this. All right, all right. No, oh, yeah, the people are now starving. Yes. I know you. Uh, if there was just one guy on the, on this, it would be easy. <clears throat> oh. Well, thanks for that. Let's have my population start. Very draconian of me, I know, but uh, it might, might just be the thing to do. Uh, let's get a, a baker here, and then we'll get another cider guy. I don't know, some of my people are just going to starve to death, which I mean, maybe that's for the best. Yeah, the, the, the maturity of the grain isn't, like, uh, going down that well. And I kind of overestimated how, like, um... I don't know what it's called. I've overestimated how fast it would take to harvest resources, I guess. Yes, that's the, that's my big issue. Possibly the maximum life there, which is unfortunate, but that's fine. Alicia. I'm gonna beat someone up. I'm mess you up, buddy. We get a carpenter here. Hey, get over here. 
Yeah, this is this sucks really badly. Wow. This is this is what happens when you don't feed your kids, boys. Is that Miller? Yeah. I wish I could buy resources, but I don't think I can. So much food in the tavern, guys. Um, I have poor revolting population. Whatever shall I do, honestly? I should make them with the serfs. So, this is all kinds of weird for me, honestly. Yes? If I change the job that they have, they... Oh, God, they reset. That's funny. They yes. reset their hunger. see everything from you can you not how many times do I have to teach you this lesson old man oh he just turned into Danny Phantom all right ignore the starvation I guess for now because I, I can't do anything about the post-apocalyptic world we're living in. I bet as soon as food goes in, it just immediately, like, is, like, eaten up by the population. This is like the Soviet Union, actually. This is the, the, the Soviet's, like, um, national, um, foresty area. I don't know. You know, build me a second farm and maybe we can speed up the production of how this grain is made. Yeah, yeah, now we're having like actual excess food there. Population is still dying, but you know, yeah, take your blessings how it is, I suppose. That's that's how I'm going to look at it. There are the haves and the haves not in our civilization, you know, much in the same way as our civilization, you know. Um, our human civilization, that is. You know, I think every country has some issue with poverty, is what I'm trying to get at. Uh, let's let's go for the farmer, second McDonald over here, old McDonald right there, just chilling out. You know what we could do? We should probably get rid of the the, the wood here. We should really get rid of the wood here. Like, I mean, I'm talking complete Lorax deforestation. Is what I'm saying. Um, you need to fell. We we only need to fell these trees because they're just. There's so much of them. There's so much. There's, there's too much for us to really manage here. Yeah, so I've made it so that um, whoever gets the grain first will be the um, 
the baker. The baker will get the grain first. Um, the only problem is that we do need you know, grain for the, you know, the cows. Oh, there is a cow being produced. If we kill the cow, oh my god. This is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. Where's meat? How do I, how do I, how do I change meat? Yeah, because I, oh, no, 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 the, the cow hide is different. Right. Right, I forgot about that. Our population. Our population is so dead. Yes. I kind of see the um, amount of resources we have right now. Oh, now we're just gonna die. Quick, to the battlements. Kill for food. It's either, it's either the sword or your own head. You know, this should take care of our population issues though. And our food issues. No, not the sawmill, please, 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 chill, 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 no! Alright, you guys, all of you need to go on the offense. I declare jihad. On these guys over here. Go forth and conquer. Hey, I said jihad. That means jihad. Now go. Okay, now with half our population turned into warriors, um. I don't know, that might fix our issues? I don't, I don't know. Depends on what our issues really was, right? Um. Oh my god, the war! The war never changes. They outnumber us quite a bit, actually. But we've managed to rebuild our population so fast. Guys, we, we just need food. Somebody buy something from a marketplace. Can somebody get something from Amazon? That's all I, that's all I require. Yes? Yeah, no, I know where we fucked up. We didn't build, we didn't build fast enough, I feel, you know? Yeah, I'm good on a tannery, actually. I'm, I'm actually stellar, uh, without a tan, a tannery. I would love to get a sawmill again, but if he dies again, I don't, I don't know what to say. I need to call a truce with these, with these knights over here. Oh shit! A baker. The baker is gone. The most important unit in our whole arsenal is gone. How are we able to afford this big ass fort? Actually, it's something that I'm trying to wrap my head around. Yeah, maybe a third farm would be fine. Yeah, our whole economy is based on grain. Should have built like a lot of farm. I did not know that the farmers would be this slow to gather grain. Yeah, I guess I'll just build like more stone roads here so that I can get closer. Maybe, maybe that's what I'll do. I'll just make things a little bit closer. Where am I in my fort? Hey, build my fort. Or die. Carpenter? And a sawmill. Right? Oh, oh, right. You're starving. You're star- I forgot my people were starving. I- I forgot all about that, you know? I was just like, damn. 
Yeah, I wonder what's happening, huh? And then they all, they all immediately go, food, food, quick! I'll sell my child for a piece of bread. But little do they know I've been hoarding the food this whole time. This whole time I've been hoarding the food. You know what this game needs? Like, multiple workers per building. That's what it needs. Like, uh, Settlers. Yeah, Settlers actually does the exact same stuff that this game does. Do I have any more clubs? I don't. I don't even have any more clubs, it's funny. Just the farmers are doing all they can, but we're not like Sumeria. We don't have that bet uh, that good of like a I don't yes. know. A a culture of farming, I guess. I don't even know. I don't even know where we went wrong, honestly. It just, it all happened so fast. Like, we have two loaves of bread right here, and they're being delivered. But as soon as they're delivered, there's a, there's a horde of people that just, like, absorbs the food. Look, you see, it's, as soon as it's made, it's taken. Like, I don't know, do we have enough, that's the thing, do we have enough grain? That's really the big thing there. These were rich, that's, that's all I gotta say. That's all I gotta say on the subject, we're rich. So it doesn't even matter. It will matter eventually, so. There is, there is indeed that. I'm just waiting for the orange AI to understand how poor I am and then just kill my people. Farmers get to work faster. We need so much more grain. Yeah, all, all grain needs to go just right there. Maybe I'll just let my people starve and I'll, I'll just see what happens. Hey, a bull tower. I don't know what a bull tower does, but I would love to find out. Oh no! The first scouts! This very well be, will be our Armageddon, actually. Can't even hire militia, guys. Quick! Get your imaginary bats. Oh, damn. Hey, can I have a 10 minute no truce? 10 minute, uh, 10 minute ceasefire. No, but this... This is about it, actually. I think I think this is a good time to stop and go, Master Ophelis. You need to pick up a book and learn how to run your own town. But anyway, I'll see you guys next time. If you want to see me fail this game more, let me know. And bye-bye. Take care.